I mean, look at this. So we're just about to get to the top of Ben Braggy, which is home to the Highland Wildcat trails. Where when they were built, they were the longest mountain bike descent in the UK. And that also meant that had the longest climb. But luckily, look, our e-bike. So here we are, the top of Ben Braggy. Top of Monumental, the black, or I think the upper black, I think it's split into two. So let's give it a blast. It is very quite windy. And by very quite, I mean pretty. Okay. Now, there's a couple of these rocks. The drops are a little bit scary in the wind, but I'm glad my bike is an e-bike. So, oh, what's this one like? Oh, big. <laughs> Pretty relentless. They love the rocks. Also, a place you might consider chucking a couple of extra PSI in the tires. Oh, for stuff like this. Some of them are quite sharp, I think, trying to pick your line. There we go. Oh, it keeps going. Just off the brakes, I think. Uh, I don't want to drag my tire over the sharp rock. Yeah, there we go. But yeah, especially on a heavy bike like this, just keeping your head up, looking ahead a bit. It's going to make all the difference to your tire and last it all the way down. How big is this? Whoa! Wasn't as straight as I thought it would be. But we live, so we will carry on. <laughs> Look at these rocks, it's very cool. Very cool. I think just one in the Viking. Whoa! What oh, line choice we're going to have? Good choice, I think. A little wee gully thing. Wow. Oh, that might have been a wee. Rim ding, uh, but we're all right. Close to the, in fact, other than the bigger drops, I think with slow enough speed you can roll off everything. Okay. Oh, I wouldn't roll that one though. <laughs> Whoa, wow. That's a wee bit steep, but we're all right. How big this one? Whoa! <laughs> Some of them don't go as straight as you might hope they would. <laughs> oh my god. Wee bit scary, but... We can still soldier it on. Yeah, if you're... If you're quick enough to... Oh dear. If you're quick enough to get your front wheel off the ground, the drops all seem pretty good. Wee! <laughs> Tell you what, this is a lot more fun than I remembered it. Hi there. Whoa. Beat them down, that's the main thing. Whoa, that! Don't roll that one. <laughs> yeah, if you come into the drops expecting there to be a drop, you're going to be all right. High line, black goes left. Actually, I think black went right. I think we've got the signs mixed up. Oh, here. Oh, that was a rim ding. Let's go high this time. Oh. Wow. 
Oh, this is our new pet. What's this we have here? Whoa! You can roll that if you want. Oh, this is all new! I think. Yeah, this is where it comes out of the way. Oh, this is definitely new. Oh. Oh. And here's the top of what I think is the red. Ah, so yeah, black, thumbs up. More fun than I had last time. I don't know if that's down to me being better at mountain biking or having an e-bike, but I actually enjoyed it. And then on the e-bike, even that was worth the, the pedal up. It was good fun. So hopefully it comes across in the video. Now we've got the red called Valhalla. Black and the red share it down here, but it is a red graded trail as far as I know. Let's find out. <sighs> Big gear. I think this is a bit more flowy than the black. So, um, ooh, still got some weed. Still got some fun features. As you can tell by wee he's saying. Wee! Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> wow! Wee! <laughs> there are some sharp rocks towards the... Whoa! I was not going fast enough for that. I didn't look at that sign. Wee! So just be a wee bit mindful of where you're landing your back wheel. Oh yeah. There's a big... a little bit. It's a little bit windy there in the air. <laughs> oh, that was a sharp one. I uh, shook the back wheel up a bit. Yeah, definitely already more flowy than the black. It's probably been four years or so since I've been here. 2018 or 19, I think. I think these grips are a wee bit too thick for me. Here we are, the lower red. It is a fire road, so just check. I think the walkers use this fire road as well, so... Don't run any dogs down. What? Again, some of the landings aren't as straight as maybe you'd expect. Oh, a little bit loose. this. Oh dear. <laughs> that was 20% more chunky than I thought. Bottomed out the rear there. I don't think those drops are the fastest by any means. But you might as well do it just to say you've done it. Like this. There's no... What's this? That was fuck. There's no huge consequences to coming up short on them other than there's sometimes a couple of sharp rocks in the landing. That one's fine. Didn't know where the jail went there. Or there. Oh, oh dear. You know what? This is a lot more fun than I remembered it being. Probably down with a few more gears I. But luckily I didn't bring a pump. There's nothing I can do about it. Oh this is a big table top. What? <laughs> Tell you what. I'd never be worried about overshooting that. I'm nowhere near good enough. Wee! Oh this would be another jump, is it? Yeah. Oh we cleared that one. Whoa! Cleared that one! Oh, there is another one. Didn't clear that one. Fantastic. And that, technically, I think, is the bottom of the red. We are back at the car park. Um, obviously, we've just been up there. So if you've enjoyed this, then um, please subscribe. Because 90% of the people who will see this video aren't subscribed. And if you would like to see more of these videos, then by subscribing, it's harder to miss one. Um, so, yeah. For anyone interested, one bar is what I've used. 
my or bear rise to go up but I'm not going to go up four more times because I did my heart would explode on the way back down um, so yeah I think I'm going to go up for a half lap we're just going to do the red but yeah thanks for watching um, check out this video this one is an absolute cracker it's one of mine um, I don't know what it is but I hope you'll enjoy it thank you